So I want to talk about something that I think is a real sort of stumbling block for a lot of people who are trying to learn how to program a computer at the moment, or just thinking about learning to program a computer for the first time. And these people, they won't have an understanding of any programming languages at all, so they'll be looking to learn their first language. And something that I found, or at least this was my experience when I tried to learn my first programming language, was that I thought that every programming language would sort of have a similar level of dif difficulty. So you learn the first programming language and then you know that's going to be a very very hard process if you're a beginner because you're going to learn all the fundamental concepts of programming and then what I originally thought was that all that time and effort that I spent learning that one language I'd have to restart from scratch every time I wanted to learn another sort of sub subsequent language to do something different but really that's not the case at all. What actually happens is that when you learn that first programming language, you also learn, as I just mentioned, the sort of fundamental skills and understanding that you need to be able to program a computer in general, and then really the language itself is more just sort of the syntax and a few things that are specific to that language, which are really not, not that time consuming to learn. And as a beginner, the majority of the time that you'll spend uh, learning that language is actually not learning the language itself, but just the fundamentals of programming a computer. So that means that when you go and learn another language, it's going to be much, much easier to pick up that second language if you're already a really good programmer in the first language that you learn.